Hey, Geeks, Tim Tibbetts with MajorGeeks.com. Today we're going to take a look at managing, deleting your restore points, free up this space, use less space, etc. What I like to do before we get into that is to clean up what we have. We'll do that by starting File Explorer and we'll find our main drive, typically C. Right click and hit Properties. There's a couple steps we have to do here, no big deal. You're going to want to find Disk Cleanup right here. When that brings the disk cleanup up, we want to do clean up system files. This will allow us to get to the more options tab, which you now see here. Under the more option tabs, there is your system restore. And by simply cleaning this up right here, we actually delete everything but the most recent restore point. Give that a second. And once we're done with this, we can now actually go in, oops, hit okay and delete files. There we go. And then we can go in and manage our system restore points. There is a couple of ways to do this. You're going to want to get into your system properties protection. Uh, while you can navigate in through the control panel, I like to do the shortcut here. Press your Windows key plus R and type in with proper caps, system, capital P properties, capital P protection. This is your system properties protection. So we're right here at the tab we need to be at. Now we can go over here to configure. Oh, I got it off. Bear with me here. I forget about that. Turn it on. There we go. So as you can see, once you've clicked configure, you're here and you have your max usage. Typically, it uses a good chunk of space. So I would bring this down to maybe 10%. And the reason for that is if you don't only need the last couple of restore points. It will delete everything when it runs out of space, meaning it'll only use that certain amount of space. It's explained to you right here, actually. So, you know, it depends how many restore points you think you need, how much space you want to give up. You can tinker with it and come back. It's very easy to do. Now, if you didn't do the cleanup on the previous one, here you can delete everything but the one restore point. The most recent so the only reason I had us do the other one is I like to make sure we got rid of all the old stuff which probably would have been done anyway but hey you never know with Windows right so we click delete right here click continue on the scary scary message and you're done leave this wherever you want it click apply and or OK and you are done so now you've cleaned up any of the junk that's sitting in there from older restore points got yourself down to having one and it's that simple so Hopefully we helped you out. Let me know in the comments. Click a thumbs up if you liked the video. Click subscribe if you've got time. You know the drill. Thanks for watching. See you next time.